<laughs> Yo, what's up everyone? Welcome back to another video today. It's a squad builder and something I really enjoy doing. Now, before we get into this, um, I want to say that I just destroyed opponents with this team. Now, we start off with left wing in form Neymar, right wing, Sam and Nasri, man of the match, and um, of course, center attacking mid team of the season, Rooney. I've been wanting him so badly, I've been waiting for an in form especially. And he does deserve at least one or two in the past uh, throughout the season. Anyway, Matic in center mid. Wow, Matic is so important in this team. He doesn't look it when you look at his stats, to be honest. And Cahill as well. His pace has just been upgraded insanely. He's fast, solid, strong, great tackler. Ramirez, what to say? He's like that, He's like that. you know, he's like a Mascherano kind of player in the sense that he's like an unsung hero sometimes. You know, the, the, he just runs up and down, mops up on the pitch. So useful. And Marcelo and left back along with David Luiz to help Neymar get, well, Marcelo to help Neymar get full cam. And then we have David De Gea in goalkeeper position. Right back, we're going to go with Kyle Walker. And of course, I'm saving that position for Coleman when he gets a team of the season as well. Or whoever else, let's see. We don't really know how it's going to go. And then we have Info Maguire to play up front in striker position. Now that team looks golden, I know. Um, one thing to say about this team is no sluggishness. I kid you not. Now, a lot of problems when you make a full informed team or reasonably almost full informed team is sluggishness. I've said this time and time again, but for this team it's not the case. It was fantastic. I literally played three games with it for the squad builder, and then I still use the squad anyway, And because I was doing a, uh, a team of the season Rooney review. By the way guys, if this video hits 300 likes, team of the season Rooney will be out straight after it. And I played six games with it as well. I won every single one. Uh, I think three to four rage quits as well. And the team of the season, Rooney, bagged himself 17, what was it, 18 goals or something? 17 goals in 6 games as well as 3 assists? Wow! And, I mean, a lot of people, the first thing that they were thinking is, and that's surely, you, I mean, you must have set it up. Because whenever someone thrashes someone, it's either you've been accused of setting it up. I mean, stuff like that, look at that shot, you can't really set up a shot like that. This guy, Rooney, uh, I mean, Neymar, Rooney, see, Rooney has a fantastic shot, he has some great passing, so he can be re involved as a great playmaker and then it's always nice to have a five star skiller like Neymar in there to just you know always do those nice bit of trickery you know he'll do something like this right he'll just pull something out from nothing going into the box very weak so you know why not pull him down give this guy a red card two yellows yep you're off mate yeah go on Elara Mendy um 3-0 already in the first half look at this just check this out Wayne Rooney outside the foot shot I mean do I need to say anything else I mean it's just amazing and you know, by the way, guys, I've been doing that Battle of Expensive Teams series, and a lot of people have been a bit nervous because of, you know, they don't want to show their game attack because many people out there will, you know, if the guy comes up with Pele and stuff, they're going to be a bit nervous. But don't worry, now I've hidden the game attack at all times. Like, now you can see it's just the number or maybe the uh, player name. I'll switch it around. I think it's better to have the player name. I don't even know why I'm debating it. That's such a weird <laughs> thing. Anyways, here is, I'm not too sh sure who that is. I think that's Wayne Rooney. I think Samir Nazri, sorry, I'm not too sure. Cuts it back and just hits off the crossbar, Samir Nazri. Here's Neymar. What can you do? What can he do? The number 10. Well, for my team. <laughs> he does a fake shot. Fake shot again. Will he finish it? Yes, he does. Makes it 5-1. What a player. Guys, if you have the coins for this team, by the way, it sums up to around 3 million with the market crash. Remember to look at the dates. Somewhere down the line, someone could be watching this video ages later. Could be a lot cheaper by then. And right now, it's going literally. When I bought this, it was 3 million because Team of the Seasons had come out as well. But I think it, you could get it for 2.8, 2.7 as well. If you wait a bit longer, it could even drop down more. And you can enjoy this team if you are wealthy on FIFA. If you're not, I'm really sorry if this is putting you off. I don't mean to do that. But I want to show you guys the best um, videos as I can. And I think Neymar, I'm sure you guys will agree, Neymar deserved player of that game. That's for sure. I very rarely will put a picture out of a man of the match, well-performed player. But uh, Neymar deserves it. And every time someone puts a phenomenal performance in, there will be a man of the match picture there for that person especially. So here's Neymar again. Plays it to Aguero. Aguero plays it to Wayne Rooney. That shot, look at him. He's fantastic. I hope his... <laughs> I went very English there. He's fantastic. So this guy rage quits as well. And we're going to the final game. So I was going to change my... Oh, that's a nice team to come up against. I was going to change my method of how I do squad builders to just putting all the best highlights at the end of the video but I think it makes it more spontaneous to have it as three games or four games because then you can see how the team plays in general rather than having mixed collective clips of uh, the team's best performances because that does not do justice as to how the team played because you can you can just make it look good like that 
<clears throat> I always like a review or two when a player misses now and then hits the post. It kind of, I don't know, it kind of helps on that review as well. So I love doing it like this, like we're going through a whole tournament and it's really interesting this way. You can get a good idea of how the team really plays. And every time this my opponent scored, he really did an annoying celebration. It went on until the most you could actually do it and that was a really nice header. I really respect when my opponent scores a really nice goal. And I think a, re a header is just outside where the penalty spot is. Um, I think, you know, it's really difficult to score like that. Keep us really well there with a the I think that was a great save, but Rooney... Ah, oh, what a player he is. Guys, if you have the coins for him... A lot of people do, because a lot of my subs now, they take part in that battle of expensive teams, and I know they have a lot of coins. You should make a team like this. You can always remove most of the informs that are in that position. For example, you can remove a Neymar, because he's left-wing inform. You can remove the likes of Marcelo inform, and Cahill inform, team of the season, De Gea team of the season, and you could afford this team to a certain extent, and it can still function the same way. Just Wayne Rooney might be a little different because of his, you know, his big upgrade, but uh, he's just fantastic. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. I've left a little summary as well at the end of it. You can just read it, pause it, and read it of how this team really felt and how it functioned if you're going to make this. Remember, guys, 300 likes will be great. I'm not going to force and ask for 5, 600. I'll be really happy with that. And stay tuned for my big pack openings as well through every single team of the season that comes out during the next four or five weeks. And uh, follow me on Twitter if you want to get into any of my pink slips, etc. I'm pink slipping a whole team of the season. All, Oh yeah, stay tuned for that. Peace, guys.